Hey there and welcome, welcome, welcome back to my channel. I'm Monique Nicole, aka Sushi Sim on IG and the gallery. I'm here with something a little different. I'm here with a quick tutorial on how you can change the name of your lots and worlds in The Sims 4. The first thing that you want to do is you want to have um, Sims 4 Studios. So um, go ahead and download or open the newest version of Sims 4 Studios. Once you're in Sims 4 Studios, you're going to go ahead and click on My Projects on the right hand side. And when you open that, um, make sure it's selected to your saves. You're going to go down and click on your saves. And then you're going to go to uh, My Documents, Electronic Arts, The Sims 4, you know, where your, your game is actually saved at. And you're going to click on the most recent save. Okay, once you've uh, opened the most recent save, you're going to go ahead and go down, scroll down until it gets to save game data. So you're going to click on that and then you're going to scroll down on the right hand side and go down to where it says neighborhoods. And next to the neighborhoods, you're going to click on where it says edit items. And once you get in here, you can see that um, these are the different items. Like you see Solani here. Um, you see these are, these are the different worlds. You see I've already changed that world. Um, Sylvan Glade. You have all your worlds in here. You have Brightchester. And this is where you can actually change the name of um, your your lots in Brightchester. For example, if you go, we're gonna open up Brightchester. And if you go next to edit items uh, next to lots, you can see the different halls in Brightchester and you can customize that and you can customize them to make your college um, you know the way you want it whether you want it realistic or anything like that this is where you can go in and change the names of the different towers um, but I'm not going to be doing that in this tutorial I'm just going to go ahead and change um, I'm gonna go ahead and change Evergreen Harbor I want to go ahead and make that Miami so I'm gonna scroll down these neighborhoods until I get to um, Evergreen Harbor So now that I'm in Evergreen Harbor, I'm just going to go ahead and change the name of it and I'm just going to change it to Miami. And then I'm just going to delete this current description that they have for Evergreen Harbor and I'm just going to like change it into something random. Okay, now that I'm done with that, I'm going to go ahead and click save and exit out of that. 
and then I'm going to go into my game after it has saved and I clicked OK. So we're here in my game and we're going to go ahead and go to the main menu and you can see that Evergreen Harbor is now Miami. Um, if we click on it, you can also see that the description has been changed and that's all you have to do. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to hit that subscribe button and hit the little bell to be notified whenever I post. Thank you for watching. Bye.